A dense fog advisory in effect until Monday, December 4th, 9 a.m. What's the wind like today? Currently, it's breezy at 3.5 miles per hour. Today, expect a light breeze around 5.8 miles per hour. What's the temperature? What's the weather like? Right now, it's 72 degrees Fahrenheit. Today, expect a high of 84 degrees. Thank you. Absolutely. Happy to help. Hey guys, it is... It is Monday, December 4th. Good morning, guys. I'm sorry, been... I'm having trouble with that right now. Thank you. Anytime. Literally. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. <laughs> um, I've been up since about four or five ish this morning. That's that. What I want to do this morning is talk to you guys about some things i don't want to take into 2024 with me i just want to leave them all behind in 2023 child wish i could leave 100 of these pounds <laughs> back in 2023 <laughs> however i did not put in the work to leave them back in 2023 so they're gonna come with me but hopefully they won't stay because I got some things I need to take care of. Anyway, but yeah, there's a list of things. <laughs> yes, a list. One of the things I don't want to take, and my list is in no particular order, just a list of things that I just don't want to take with me in 2024. One of those things is procrastination. Your girl is a big time procrastinator. And... It's wild because I don't procrastinate when it comes to my job. I just procrastinate when it comes to me directly. When it affects me directly. For instance, I knew I was going to my mom's for Thanksgiving. Do you all know I waited till Wednesday morning to decide what to wear? And what to do with my hair. I want to take procrastination, stick it in a box, put a lock on it, and leave procrastination in 2023. Yeah, I, that's what I want to do. Another thing that I want to leave in 2023 is bad eating habits. So every overweight person you see, they're not overweight because they are a overeater. They're overweight because they have bad eating habits. For instance, I eat normal proportions. You may look at my weight and say, girl, my problem is I eat at the wrong time and I eat all of the wrong things. I am a big time junk food person. So a lot of my calories that I put on, and I'm being very transparent now, it's really from junk. Like, I eat a lot of um, chips. You know how some the old folks say, I got a sweet tooth. Baby, I got a whole mouth full of sweet tea, baby. And I love cakes. I love my pies. I will go in my kitchen and bake me a homemade caramel cake and a sweet potato pie. And if I take my ass in that kitchen and bake a caramel cake and a sweet potato pie, I'm going to eat them. I'm going to call these children. And I'm going to come over here. Tell them come over here and get this stuff out my way. But I'm going to eat my fair share. I'm going to eat at least two slices of the cake. And two slices of the pie. Of the pie. And I don't need that in my life right now. I really don't. I want to leave inactivity in 2023. Because I've gotten real comfortable with being comfortable. So I want to leave comfortable. Wait, wait a minute. You have to be careful what you ask for. I want to leave being inactive in 2023. I want to get up and move my body in 2024. More than I did in 2023. But I am a overthinker. 
I think on things. And before I know it, I've been on spun it into a whole nother scenario. I want to, <laughs> I want to, I want to lead that in 2023. Mm -hmm. I know another thing I want to leave in 2023. I, I'm going to have to work extra hard on that. Cussing. Yeah, I need to leave that in 2023 because your girl be cussing. Okay. I be cussing, I be cussing, and I will cuss you out, your mama out, your grandmama out. Like, I don't discriminate when it comes to cussing. I know I need to work on that, but you get me in the right time and place, in the right mood, baby, I will cuss your whole family out. You hear me? And be ready to fight. Listen, let's leave all the old stuff. Back in 2023, bring on the new stuff into 2024 because it's a new version of us, right? I mean, new year, why not upgrade? It need to be a new version of us. So, procrastination, we leaving her in 2023, right? Bad eating habits, we leaving it 2023. We leaving it, we leaving it. We getting up and moving in 2024, okay. All that sitting down, sitting on our ass and getting big or bigger. No, we ain't doing that no more. We ain't doing that no more. We ain't doing that no more. It's all about us now. It's time for us to take care of us, okay? And see about us. You hear me? Because nobody going to do it for us. See about yourself. 2024. But you can start right now. You can start today. Take care of you. Today, today, you need to take care of you because they're not going to do it for you. You got to want it and you got to do it for yourself. What are some things that you don't want to carry with you into 2024? Let me know in the comments below. I know there's some things that you want to leave in 2023. Let me know in the comments below. This is all this video was about it's coming up to the end of the year a new year is on the horizon and um i'm asking the lord to bless each and every one of you i'm asking him to increase your territory i'm asking him to increase your financial freedom i'm asking him to increase your health i'm asking him to increase your faith increase your family life increase your happiness your healthiness increase honey increase i hope i pray that he makes your situation better than what it was in 2023 I wish nothing but happiness for each and every one of us. 2024, let's strive to be a better us, a better version of, of us. You know what I mean? An upgraded version. We're smart technology. We're God's technology. We need to update. Mm -hmm. And each and every one of us knows what we need to do to upgrade. 